Hello and welcome to Wayne Bombstead Outdoors. This hunt takes place in the open range area of the northern Cape province of South Africa. I am hunting with my good friends at Watts Trophy Hunting. I'm in pursuit of the tiny Steenbuck. Well, we're in the blind where I shot my kudu late yesterday afternoon. During that uh, hunt, I saw this real nice uh, Steenbuck. He's about four inches, and that's considered a trophy in anybody's book. So uh, I'm set up here again tonight, and hopefully he'll show up. The Steenbuck is a very elusive but common game animal in the southern African region and is one of the smallest species of antelope. Only standing about 16 to 24 inches tall at the shoulder, the Steinbach is a very small target for an archer. During the cool times of the year, you can see Steinbach moving around during the day. However, during the hotter times, these little antelope go nocturnal with their travels. And with eyesight that is very much cat-like, they can see just as well in total darkness as they can in daylight. They also have lightning fast reflexes as Wayne will experience on this hunt. And it looks like a clean mess. I just shot right over the top of his back. Just barely missed him. But there's not any blood or anything on this bolt. So we're gonna have to try to get him again. We'll give him a couple of days to, to rest up after that scare. Oh man. Well, here we are in the Steenbuck blind at a tin shanty as I call it. I'm here to redeem myself on that miss that I did the other night on that steenbuck. This place that I'm at right here, it's in the open range area and there's uh, quite a few uh, steenbuck around. So anyway, keep your fingers crossed and uh, stand by. Let's see what happens tonight, folks. Well, Wayne settled into that tin shanty with hopes that his Steinbuck would show up. He had several other Steinbucks show up and cruise through the area, including this young male. And it wasn't long before Wayne's attention was drawn to that young male as he kept looking over his shoulder and back behind him. And then Wayne saw what that young male was looking at. It was his Steinbuck from two days earlier. Well, that little steam buck made his way in and fed just for a very short period of time. And then he spooked out. Wayne thought all hopes were over with when he saw that young steam buck run away. A short time period passed and a young female steam buck came in to feed.
Wayne continued to notice that this little female Steinbuck kept looking back and behind her several times. And then he saw him. The Steinbuck from two nights prior was coming back. And Wayne hoped this time he would come in. Folks, <laughs> the little, the little steampunk, he's down. I saw him fall. Two nights ago, this little guy came in just before dark. <clears throat> I had to rush my shot, and I missed him. But tonight, he came in. I didn't rush my shot. He presented a nice broadside shot. Whammo, I redeemed myself on this little steampunk. <laughs> I tell you what, I'm going to give Phil a message here and Charles. Let them know I got this little steam butt down so they can come and pick me up. And I'm going to go out there and recover them and before it gets dark. Oh man, look at that little guy. He came in and, and presented me with a great shot tonight. Uh, two nights ago, I missed him. And now I have gotten him. I redeemed myself on that miss. I didn't miss tonight. Got him exactly where I was supposed to get him. Oh, he's a beautiful little animal, folks. I tell you, from the biggest of animals to the smallest of animals, you can count on watch trophy hunting getting you on him. Let them know where you heard it too. Oh man, beautiful little animal.